Welcome to this quick overview of the CyberArk Endpoint Privilege Management Console. EPM reduces attackers' attack surface by removing local admin rights on endpoints while improving user experience and optimizing IT operations. After logging in, you will land on the Management Options page where you can select the set you want to work. Sets can be organized based on the company's need and categorized by platform, department, OU, etc. On the left side of the screen are the different modules of EPM. Beneath the welcome banner, you will find useful links to relevant CyberArk EPM docs. There are also three quick access tiles you can click for immediate access to agent optimization, agent installation, and the predefined configuration. The top menu bar is accessible anywhere in the console. Activities detected and managed by EPM policies are collected and displayed on the events management page, where you can see the events in a single list and take immediate action to protect endpoint computers. Events are viewable in both timeline and table formats. Click any event to see its raw details. The application catalog lists applications installed on endpoints detected by EPM, showing whether they are managed by EPM policy, generated events, or were found via a scan. Policies define how EPM manages endpoint activities. The default policies page provides an immediate view of all current default policies. You can set any of the policies to manage applications with a single click. EPM policy recommendations enable you to activate policy settings in a single click and apply relevant controls in your environment. Here is where you will find the option to activate EPM Quick Start policies. An application group is a list of applications grouped together for easy management. In the End User UI module, the EPM administrator controls the user experience by customizing the graphics text and dialogue balloons, as well as setting the language for messages. Administrators can also add extra controls and support, ensuring that users clearly understand the EPM interface and can work without disruptions. The Reports page provides an overview of EPM report definitions and generation. The EPM server organizes computers into categories within the My Computer module. Administrators can logically group computers while built-in categories automatically group clients based on factors. You can view the inventory of connected computers, including details like computer name, logged in user, agent connection status, and whether threat protection is enabled. In Upgrade or Uninstall Agents, you can see the computer details, upgrade or install an agent. From the Download Center, you can download the most recent agent for Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. Here you can also download tools to help administer EPM. CyberArk EPM uses static code analysis and machine learning to detect zero-day threats, generating a risk score for better policy decisions. EPM admins can leverage, from a single user interface, the use of analytics to help determine the risk profile of applications, which can help them make policy decisions. Policy audits track the way policies are used and give an aggregated view of events that are triggered when EPM applies policies to applications on endpoints. Agent configuration determines how EPM manages endpoint computers. You can create a custom configuration for endpoints. Or you can edit the general configuration. For further information on the EPM console, please visit CyberArk University or refer to the online EPM documentation which can be found at docs.cyberarc.com.